Dr. Ashish Vashisht, ENT surgeon from Manipal Hospital, Dwarka, New Delhi. And today we shall be talking about the very specific topic of cochlear implant surgery. Cochlear implant surgery, as we know, has been in the uh, has been happening for the past many years now, and is a wonderful rehabilitation procedure for uh, profoundly deaf children, adults, or young patients when they have unilateral or a both sides hearing loss. Now, normally cochlear implants are being done routinely in most good uh, ENT setups. Where we uh, come as a specialty is the complicated procedures such as cochlear implantations in cochlear ossifications, cochlear implantations in uh, erstwhile cavities and ears with discharge. These were the patients who initially or by most centers are rejected for surgery as uh, these are high risk procedures they are technically very challenging and are fraught with higher incidence of uh, perioperative and long-term complications. So we as a center specialize in all the complicated cochlear implant surgeries or surgeries of cochlear implantation in complex situations. And whenever you have been diagnosed as a profoundly deaf patient and you have been counseled regarding cochlear implants and you have certain questions in your mind regarding whether you can be implanted or not because your cochlea is due to certain reasons ossified, you had a history of uh, fractures or trauma, you already had a cochlear implant which has failed due to certain reason, due to infections or due to trauma again or is not working presently or your patient who has had ear discharge in the past has had surgeries for correction of ear discharge and you have been thinking of getting a cochlear implant done, we would request you to uh, contact with the hospital and uh, so that we can take this forward. Not all patients could be implanted but uh, definitely with the present era many investigations such as very high resolution computed uh, scans, CT scans and MRI scans uh, can help us in identifying which people can be successfully implanted. Uh, we have ample amount of research to back this up in terms of very reasonable and appropriate outcomes. We implant across ages starting from uh, 10 months of age that is uh, less than infants to 75 years of age as long as they are fit to undergo a surgery under general anesthesia. So nobody uh, in terms of their age or sex is debarred from surgery. Most complicated situations we are able to manage well through surgery. We are in a uh, referral center for complex cochlear implantation patients. So whenever you have been diagnosed with a complex situation and you are uh, not certain whether you should go on for a cochlear implant surgery or not, we request you to get in touch with us and we will definitely help you with that decision. Thank you.